World Wide Web Blue Dub with another edition of Personal Best. It's the Group 2 Mooney Valley Gold Cup. Lloyd Williams owned Pondus, started favourite, with the next fancy last start failure floating artist. Freeze the screen now to have a look through the whole field and their prices. Set the run. Racing now. Starcaster jumped away well out wide from future score Pondus. Good idea is just going to drive up and get to fourth early and also dispute third now with Attorney and also Future Score just lobbing behind those horses, the OTIs. Then came Floating Artist, who's deep and forcing on. Then Secret Blaze, Luna Flare, sound second last, and last year's winner, Miami Bound, at the end. So good idea led from Starcaster, Pondus and Floating Artist in the next line, and then Future Score. For the back, Secret Blaze, who sits on the outer of Attorney, Luna Flair third last from Sound and Miami Bound. That's the order. Past the judge with a lap of the valley to go, and it's not overly fast. Good idea for Craig Newitt by a neck. Second is Star Caster, who through its career hasn't settled in its races, but to, seems to be settling a little bit better, but did take the corner there like a bit of a crab. A length and a half away third was Floating Artist, and then Pondus the outside of Attorney, and then came Future Score. A length away then to Secret Blaze. Next the rails Luna Flair. Flair, second last sound, and at the end, Miami bound. No change on the Dean Street side at the 1400 metres, and it's the seven year old good idea. No speed in the cup by a length and a quarter. Second star caster, and then came floating artist who's tucked in between horses outside of attorney. And now, future score for Yendel is getting going. Whips up outside of the lead at the 1200 marker. So it's good idea and future score by a length and a quarter star caster. Then came Pondus, who travels well and truly off the rails from floating artist and on the fence attorney saving every inch of ground two and a half secret blaze and then came Luna Flair second last sound at the end Miami bound they run off the back 800 meters to run good idea by length future score Starcaster now travels up attorney along the inside as the leaders just to have the inclination to slightly get off the fence attorney searching for runs floating artists only two off then secret blaze Luna Flair sound and Miami bound at the end of the field, only four off the lead as they pack. So 500 to go. Future score. Starcaster now joined by Pondus, who's about to let go. Attorney gets up underneath of them, followed by Sound, who's running on around the outside with Luna Flair, Secret Blaze, and then Floating Artist up around the corner. It's Pondus at the 200 metres going for home from Sound, Luna Flair, Secret Blaze, then Floating Artist. It's now Pondus grabbed by Luna Flair and Sound, the nine-year-old on the outside of the 100. Luna Flair from sound, Luna Flair floating artist coming late, Luna Flair Luna Flair beat floating artist sound and Pondus, then Miami bound next future score, secret blaze Luna Flair had been showing some positive signs, the six year old mare is not even nominated for the Melbourne Cup though, most likely to turn up again in two weeks time in the Queen Elizabeth over 2600 metres at Flemington Pondus, what a disappointment may still make the Melbourne Cup field though if there are some more withdrawals. Check the odds, pick a winner. Get locked and loaded with Wishbet. If you like this channel and you love the Melbourne Cup, take full advantage. Simply get to the YouTube page, click on playlists and try out my Melbourne Cup lead up races playlist for 2021. Or for those interested in stats around the Melbourne Cup, try my Staying the Distance playlist. I reckon you'll love it.